So now you've done that, yes, look yes, at yes. this. And oh my goodness. Hey guys, welcome back to another video where today we're in the Smiling Critters RP. And yes, we are joined with a few people, as you can see, Twisted Quackers, Newbie, and Nexty today, where we're going to look for a new morph that's been released. Yes, but also, I've been told the game has had a major revamp. And nice. if you've played this before, or at least seen previous videos we've done on this game, you can see it does look really, really different. I mean, not only have we got ourselves now a bridge and some other kind of walkways and stuff, but there's been a revamp of this little camp that was started at, and there seems to be a very fast-flowing river. I assume that's why it's got these kind of fast anime lines or wind lines in it. I don't know, but, uh, oh. It looks like you can just run on top of it. You don't even swim. What if it is this? But what we're going to do is to go and have a look at some of these new stuff, as well as how to unlock the daisy character from Poppy Playtime. Perfect. So I'm going to turn the sprint on and just have a look at some other stuff like this here. So there's a lot of kind of footpaths and fencing. And it seems to make it a lot easier to navigate around and not get too lost like you did before. But it looks like the tower, the watchtower has disappeared. Catnap's house is still here. But there is a building here which says opening soon. Now, I don't know what it's going to be, but I'm quite excited if it's somewhere like an actual shop to go into and have a look at some stuff. Because that would be pretty awesome. But that did used to be... I believe next to some kind of what I thought was a graveyard, but now it looks like a nice picnic area with a beautiful looking fountain. We're running around further from here. What we're going to do is go around past Catnap's house. I don't think there's anything new in there. Looking at the kind of update notes, there was nothing mentioned about Catnap's house or anything changing in it. I know we don't need to go in there to be able to unlock this new character. So what we're going to do is head over to the house you start with, which is Dog Day's house, which has got obviously some slight revamp. So press the button and you go inside. Wait, what? I thought you used to be able to just run into this. Oh, okay. So looking out the window, it looks like we're quite high off the floor. This is actually completely different. Although the TV's not working. How am I supposed to watch the trailer? We still got some goofy looking characters. As well as the note to unlock dog day that we did last time. You got the beautiful picture. Now, it says they got rid of the basement. And I think they're right. I can't get through the door. Bro, no, not to worry. But what have we got upstairs? Is everything here still the same? We've got some flowers. Now, this for sure is new. There was never flowers in here previously. And with the other rooms... Oh, they've moved the location for the badge. So this badge used to be in the basement. I remember this. And then obviously the bedroom looks the same with another badge you can get here. So with a really quick overview of what's changed, which includes the Dog's Day's house, I think it might be time to go and check out where we find this Daisy character. So we just made it to the front of Dog Day's house. Yes, this hasn't changed at all. This is how we've remembered seeing it. You've got a little picnic table here with a few cool pictures on it and some goodies in the picnic basket. Clearly, you've got some spicy Doritos and you've got the uh, ability to have a floating picture which you can interact with. Oh, it cycles through them and it looks like Quackers is doing it for me. Why, well, thank you. And this here is definitely new. I've not actually seen this previously. And this is basically the character we're going to unlock today. And someone has literally just spamming the button to spin it at a thousand miles an hour. Now, I have just noticed here, it's saying, stay tuned, house interior update next. Does this mean I get my own house? Do I get to be one of the smiling critters and have my own cool little house that I can decorate? Hey, if that is the case, that'd be so cool. I'll be looking forward to that. But what we're going to want to do is to head on up this long muddy path so this is the same path we took to head out and find the little mouse character and also dig up dog day's bone huh? now obviously this looks a bit different to what i remember seeing but it is still where we need to go to unlock this new morph we want for today and when you get to this open lake area well actually i've just noticed everything's changed here as well You've got what looks like a little beach resort. You've got yourself little chairs and a big parasol. You've got another shop here saying fish and bait. I assume we're going to be able to do a bit of fishing and do maybe a little competition. Oh, hey, that'd actually be pretty cool. Now, I see Twisted is looking at what looks to be a poster. And you've got Dog Day kind of taking Catnap away. Or actually what it is, I read that one completely. Oh, no. Catnap is giving Dog Day a piggyback. There's a sign that says Playtime Co. encourages adults to keep 
an eye on their children before it's too late. What does it mean by before it's too late? I mean, I know what it means, and I know you know what it means. Let's just hope that doesn't actually happen. The next is saying, oh, Dizzy Nap, how do I unlock Daisy? Or well, at least Miss Daisy. Well, let me show you. What you want to do is head over here, go for a little swim in this direction towards the waterfall. This is a key point because it's easy to find and also easy to kind of swim towards. And as you get to here, you'll see this big rock, in which case you want to look at it and turn left. And look at that. There's a huge cutout with a door in the side of a mountain. How crazy is that? I mean, totally. But when you go inside, you'll be presented with a tiny flower, which is the size of one next to That is how we're measuring heights at this point. And he's saying it's a really smelly flower. What do you mean it's smelly? So if we go into this, you will see that the badge has appeared saying we've unlocked the cartoon Daisy. Now, I'm pretty excited to check this out because when it says cartoon in front of the names, well, usually this means it's going to be a very high quality morph like we've seen with Dog Day and obviously Catnap. So let's see what we can do. Uh, we'll hit the morph button and have a quick look for cartoon Daisy at all. Oh. Gotta rejoin. So if we head into the morphs button, I can see we've now got Cartoon Daisy. You had to reset or basically join another server. So now you've done that. Yes, look yes, at yes. this. And oh my goodness, isn't it so adorable? I'll answer that for you. Yes, it is. Although next is saying, why is she really skinny? I don't know what you mean. She's got a massive head. It's more like a um, is it like a chippy version. And Quags is saying she's uh, really skinny because she a flua. She is a flua. Now I can see there's a button here that says face. And I'm quite curious to see what it does. So let's have a quick look. Oh, look, there's tons. I know it's behind my head, but look at this. We got scared. So his mouth, smile, smile too, sleep, normal. Now, I don't know if you realized or not, but uh, absolutely nothing changed. I don't think this is working at the moment. This is maybe a, a work in progress. But wait, someone has become dog day and it looks like the one from the game. That's amazing. Look at the details on this. I don't even know if that's in this game. Is that maybe Heretic Dog Day? Oh, hey, look. There's Quackers over there. Yo, Quackers, what are you doing? Hey, Dizzy. I'm going to visit my grandma. Want to come? Yeah, hopefully she lives nearby. Oh, she lives in that house there? Well, you better go first because, you know, she's your grandma and all, and I don't want to be the one to kind of intrude. Should think I'm some kind of... Oh, wow. Look at this house. It looks very familiar, though. I will say that. She should be upstairs. Amazing. Well, hopefully she's expecting us because otherwise, uh, yeah, she might not even be in her nighty. Wait, what? Oh, 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 not if I get to her first. Wait, uh, was that just a wolf? We have to get to her before the wolf does. Okay, go, 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 go. Oh, Quackers is off. Why can't I sprint any faster? What is going on? Oh, let's see, let's see. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, Quackers has just stopped. Oh, no. Okay, we found Grandma. No, Quackers is getting angry. Guys, how are we supposed to stop this from happening? I don't see anything around here to bop him on the head. Oh, Quackers, you've gotten taller. That's not Quackers. Grandma, there's a wolf next to you. I didn't know you had a dog, Quackers. <laughs> wait, what? Oh, my goodness, Quackers. Quackers, he's just oofed your grandma. That is how you unlock Miss Daisy. If you'd like to hit the like button, subscribe if you've done so many, it's super appreciated. And we will catch you in the next video. Remember to boop the snoop.